Hello everyone, thank you for tuning in to the Creative Council. My name is Natasha and today we're going to be talking about plants. So what do plants typically mean in a dream? So when you think about a plant, a plant is something that grows, right? So is it a, a plant that produces seed after, it's, oh, well, I mean all plants of, you know, ultimately have roots and seeds, but what I mean is actual like fruit seeds. Um, it can indicate, uh, you know, a reaping, a season of reaping. Um, but it also depends on what kind of, what kind of plant it is, what condition is the plant in? Is it full? Is it big? Or is it small and dry? It may indicate you need to, you need to, um, address, not address, but tend to um, something that is growing in your life or something that God is growing in your life. Um, are there fruit on the tree, the, the plant? Um, if there are no fruit on the plant, like a tree or a bush or something that produces uh, fruit, um, that could be an indication that it just is not the right timing. And um, if you're expecting fruit, then, you know, that might mean you need to wait and you know something's coming but you're just in a season of waiting because that thing has not fully come to maturity but you also want to take into consideration the color uh, what, what color are the fruits what color, color are the leaves um it could represent fruit can typically can represent in the dream uh the fruit of the spirit love joy peace patience kindness goodness faithfulness gentleness self-control uh, it just really depends on context as well. Is it something uh, more of a uh, a crop kind of plant? So like corn or uh, wheat um, or things of that nature, like a grain. Those usually indicate, um, and they usually take place in the field or in the field. That can indicate a harvest, something coming to you. Or it can indicate, you know, the Lord of the harvest, who is Jesus, sending you a harvester into the fields. So evangelism um, or something relating to the kingdom, kingdom business, something God is sending you to do um, that's going to be bigger than you, but it's something he's called you to. So being called into a field to bring people into the kingdom, to bring people into the knowledge of, of Jesus and, you know, giving them the gospel, evangelizing them. So a field uh, with corn or wheat or things like that, of that nature of grains usually indicate that something that will bring a uh, generational benefit and um, also considering what season it's in. Is it summer? Is it spring? Is it fall? Is it winter? If you are seeing a plant that's out of season, so for instance, I, you're seeing a plant that is usually a springtime plant in the fall, then that can indicate, depending on the context of the dream, the other uh, sub-focuses and elements, that can indicate, indicate something important, um, depending on the plant, like I said, because uh, certain plants are in season, certain fruits are in season. So if you're, you know, eating a pomegranate and, you know, the fall or not the fall, the, the, the summer. And I know in, in real life, we have fruit a lot of times, all times of the year, but traditionally certain fruits are for certain times. So if you're seeing a certain fruit um, out of season, season it's important to look up, like I said before in the last video, the practical, the literal and the metaphoric uh, meaning and implication behind the item, the object, or the element to give you more insight. But anyway, so looking at the seasons when it comes around, when it when it comes to the type of plant, the type of fruit, uh, the color of it, the condition of it, those kind of things will give you a lot of detail as to um, what what it is meaning for you in the dream and what God is relating to you in that dream. And a lot of times it's a conditioning dream, it's an encouraging dream, it could be a prophetic dream, just the different categories. Context is king, as I always say, and you always want to definitely bypass, not bypass, but uh, seek the Lord on the interpretation and the different meanings. And you can find like in the parables, in the 
prophetic books and the Psalms and the Proverbs, the different medicals, medical, medical, metaphors <laughs> and uh, figures of speech will give you a lot of um, wisdom and insight to what different things mean in dreams. Specific, specifically with plants, though, an uh, interesting thing is um, when you look at the, uh, the in Genesis 1, when God creates the plants and the uh, plants of the field, um, actually when you break that down in the Hebrew, uh, all the trees that are listed in the Bible are within that chapter, which is kind of cool. It's a fun fact or whatnot. If you search the scriptures, you find amazing things. But anyways, so I hope that helps. Um, you definitely want to look at the condition, the, con the context, and other elements in the dream to give you uh, insight to what that plant, tree, or whatever uh, it may be uh, means to you.